haven't changed one bit, have you? Wow. Hmm? Device. Hey, Nick. The house. It's yours. Finally, after so long. Thanks, man. It's been years, decades at least, since I've been inside this house. I lived here when I was just a kid, with my family. My mom, my siblings, my, uh, my dad. I received a call from Tobias telling me that they were finally ready with the repairs this morning. It took them long enough. <laughs> it's funny. Even after what happened, and all that time away from home, it looks just like I remembered it to be. Is my memory that precise? Uh, of course, things like the furniture and photos aren't here anymore, but hey, can't blame anybody for that. <laughs> right, right. I guess I better use that memory for something useful. I don't have the full story. Nor do I know why it happened, but I can tell you how it started. Everything else is up to you to figure out. This is the story of the night I lost my home, my childhood, and almost my family. When Five Nights at Freddy's just ended. Fala aí pessoal, sejam bem-vindos aqui a mais um vídeo e a muitos pedidos aí eu tô trazendo um detonado desse joguinho para vocês, né? The Joy of Creation, modo história. Então vamos lá. Vou passar aqui a primeira. Yes, yes, he's okay. Don't worry, he just seems uh, confused. Uh, ex excuse me, sir, can you tell me your name? Oh, look, man, if you won't talk, I'm calling the police. You can't just barge into someone's house like this. Are, are you hurt? Do you need any help? Honey, what's going on? I don't know. This man suddenly appears in our house. Nick's on the phone with me, but I don't know. Send him here. Michael! Excuse me, but just what are you doing in our house? The sun's about to go down. I don't think you should be here. Uh, yeah, I was just saying that. You, uh, you, uh, you, you look a little bit roughed up. What happened to you? I, I, I don't know. I, I can't remember. Um, I'm sorry, but, but I just, I, I just don't know. Michael, pick it up. The floor is bad. Daddy, can you help Michael? Michael was coming, it would be bad to leave him outside. Um, I, I mean, I, I guess. Can you stand? Um, I, I think so. A bit. I, I just feel a bit... Um, dizzy. Yes, dizzy. Uh, come on, man. Let me help you up. After that, Dad carried the stranger to our guest room. He thanked me for convincing my parents to let him rest in our house for a night. Or at least, while he collected his thoughts. After that, Mom put me in bed. I can't remember much about Michael, but I knew he wasn't a bad person. Or, at least he didn't look, you know, dangerous. I was young, so I guess I just didn't know any better. Certainly didn't know what a burglar was, that's for sure. Um... Not that I was implying he was, I'd never talk to him again after that. Well, except for when the storm happened. 
That's when I woke up on my bed, and I saw them. It's me, Michael. And hey, you don't say anything back to me, okay? There are monsters around that'll hear you if you do. Now, don't be scared, Nick, okay? Listen to me, and we can defeat those monsters, all right? Okay, so these monsters might look, uh, surreal. Uh, you know, don't look at them too long, or you'll feel weird and see creepy things. When you do, turn on your desk lamp next to your bed. You'll feel safe there. Uh, the more you stare at the scary monsters, the worse you'll feel, all right? Uh... All right, all right, all right, um, okay, first things first, uh, Freddy, uh, the fuzzy brown bear, uh, he's at the window, Nick, uh, he'll peek inside, close your curtains and keep them closed until you hear him leave, or else he'll get inside, uh, then there's Bonnie, the, uh, ill-tempered big purple bunny, uh, keep an eye on your door, he'll be there, uh, he's not shy at all, uh, he will knock on the door to let you know he's there. Once he opens the door, shut off the lights as fast as you can. Nicky. He can't see you well in the dark, and he'll leave. Uh, oh, but make sure you're sitting down when you do that, all right? Okay, uh, then there's the chicken. Um, that one's a little bit weird. Uh, check the closet's muffin. Uh, if she's peeking through, make sure to disable the lights. Uh, she doesn't want to be seen, but ignoring her doesn't help either. If she does catch you with the lights on, she'll scare you and stun you. Now, look, I, I know this is a lot to take in, little Nikki, okay? Just, just listen carefully and try to remember it all, please, okay? All right, last is Foxy. Uh, he'll be right beneath your bed, Nick. You'll hear scraping to the bottom of the crib when he's there. Uh, be watchful if you see his hook on the back of your bed, because soon enough, he'll be right there next to the bed. Uh, don't look directly at him, Nick. Instead, pretend to sleep. All right, just pretend to sleep. Yeah, just lie down without moving too much. Look up and close your eyes. Uh, Foxy sees eyes as if they're big, bright spotlights, okay? So if you pretend to sleep, he won't know you're there anymore. But don't open them until you know he's gone, okay? Okay, uh, so to recap, um, Freddy is at the window, so if you see him peeking, close the curtains until he's gone. Uh, Bonnie will knock on the door and open it afterwards. Uh, disable the lights and sit down until he leaves. Chica will try to stun you by scaring you, so if you see her peeking through the closet, shut off your lights and don't pretend to sleep. She'll think you're gone. And Foxy will appear under your crib and move upwards, so when he's next to your bed, pretend to sleep until you hear him leave. All right, you got all that? All right, good. Uh, uh -huh. Listen, I have to go, little buddy. Okay, just hang in there. Uh, they'll leave at 6 a.m., I'm sure of it. You can do this. Então, deixa eu explicar aqui, ó. Tem uma parada de sanidade aqui, que ele fala que você não pode ficar olhando para os animatrônicos por muito tempo, senão a tua sanidade é baixa. Sem dizer também que você tem que deixar a luz acesa aqui, para ela não piorar. Aquele ponto verde que tá piscando ali, ele representa a tua sanidade. Quanto mais perto do vermelho tiver, pior vai estar tá a tua situação. E, e quando a tua sanidade baixa muito, você não consegue jogar direito, tá? Você consegue até fechar, mas vai ser muito difícil. E assim, é, quando o Fred aparece aqui, eu apago a luz e espero ele por a cara ali para fechar a cortina, né? Ah, o Bonnie eu espero dar uma terceira batida para apagar a luz e me esconder. Ele aparece a cada três batidas. A Chica, é, se ela abrir a porta é só apagar a luz e você pode se movimentar de boa, você só não pode dormir, senão ela vem e caga toda a sanidade. O Fox, cara, é... Ele, é... ele vai aparecer o ganchinho aqui, ó, desse lado da cama. Aí você deita e espera ele, a cara dele aparecer na, na, em cima do berço, né? Aí você fecha o olho. Que daí você consegue escutar melhor a hora que ele vai embora. É, o Fred tá ali, ó. A hora que ele pôr a cara ali, eu, eu, eu apago luz. Aí. Só abre a janela quando ele faz o barulho robótico lá. Ó, sanidade ainda tá verde. Foda que demora pra passar as horas, cara. É inacreditável. Tá.
tá, segunda batida. No problem. Agora sim. Vai, põe a cabeça aí. Por isso que eu sempre apago a luz, cara. Pra evitar a chica. Acho que é a primeira batida. O Fox também apaga a luz quando ela aparece. Porque às vezes a Chica vem junto. Será que é a primeira batida do Bonnie, cara? Era. Agora foi a segunda. Quase caguei. Quase que morro. Não sei que a próxima batida o Bonnie entra. Será é que eu vou ficar olhando pra ela sangrada e cai? A cena tá quase amarela ali. Ai, pai. A sanidade tá ficando amarela. Começando a tremer já. Ó, oh, tá embaçando a vista já.
Deus, a B. Ó, deu essa piscadinha, quer dizer que a sanidade tá indo para as cuscuia. Mas nem 5 horas, o bicho aqui tá tremendo já. Primeira batida, acho que. Nada bom, tem que esperar a Chica sair primeiro. Aí eu fecho o olho. Sanidade, Doca. A Chica tá ali, eu ia acender a luz e me fuder. Complicado, filho. Teve uma vez só que eu passei que a sanidade não caiu desse jeito. Eu não sei como é que faz esse cara. Bom. É isso aí pessoal, espero que vocês tenham gostado e fiquem até o próximo.